are the things we're supposed to deal with, eh? Turned up to try and get the bus out and what have happened? Somebody has decided to throw something through my back window and smashed it completely. Wonderful, nice people about in there. Let's see if we can get in and find out uh, what the damage is. Okay, now we're inside. Something is a little bit different. The impact from the centre there is actually pushed out of the bus. So if you can see the angle just there, that is the perfect size for a piece of angle that I've cut from the coach already. So I think somebody has somehow crawled underneath and got into the coach, picked up a piece of steel and smashed it through the window. Then, for some strange reason, climbed back out and left it as it is. Why? <laughs> anyway, let's uh, try and figure out how we're gonna fix this situation. Well, it looks like it's sat in this groove on the bottom and then it's just rested on there with some sealant on the outside that's then been painted over and then it goes up the top and it curves around and then it's just sealed there that looks like all it is so we'll see what we can do with that Ooh, glass everywhere Out. Okay, it looks like here is just a, a rubber seal. I don't know whether this is a piped in seal that's just stuck all the way now because it's been in there for years or it's um, an actual rubber seal like around your windows your dog in the car because it's pretty solid. Whether I can get that rubber seal or we just use CT1. Fantastic stuff. Yeah, it looks like this is just sealant. It's on there. Once I'd knocked all the glass that I could do into the uh, into the bus, so I didn't drop it all over the road, took it down to the workshop, reversed it in so far because there was actually a car just behind the camera, um, and set up to try not to drop too much glass anywhere, uh, while I took off the remainder that was stuck all the way around the opening. section in there before I put the printer in. Oh my god! No work. Never mind. Oh. 
good. Sealant, I think. Okay. Oh and in there as well. Oh dear, oh dear. Ooh, good bit. <laughs> what was I saying earlier about no rust? Last bit of preparation, chipped out the last few bits of uh, rust and then had to nip and get Gemma from the zoo. And lucky enough, Ian said he would come back and help me as well. Why, it's, uh, it's only gonna, as it is at 78, is it 75? Yeah. It's only actually to there, so oh. if you've got slight in it, cool. we could just cut along them. Dots. Yeah, cut along the edge. And then your 75 is only to there, even if it's 80 in the middle, we'll get away without taking that off as well. Mm. And that will just clean up. There you go. 
221, so it's only Oh, perfect. Again. We've got plenty of plenty. The apples away. Yeah. decided she wanted to play with the camera. Wonderful. Yeah, that's all right. Leaning right, that is.
Apparently, this used to be a red bus. Red? Yeah. Really? Yeah, now he's put the paint off. Oh, right. <laughs> it was red there, but I didn't take that off. That was off. <laughs> it's a bloody bamboo. Right. How would you fancy doing this one? Well, again, just sort of. You know, it or it, yeah, you I don't know, you're a rough ass sometimes, you. <laughs> well, we'll not go too mad, but we'll take some <laughs> Steve likes doing everything himself, Ian. No, not, not, not that. I just, I just do tend to measure too many times. Go on, pens down. Okay, unfortunately the camera stopped uh, just as we started to stick the actual thing in. So uh, quite a lot of CT1 and a few pot rivets later, everything was secured, sealed, hopefully watertight, so we could take the coach back to the yard. Okay, quarter to eleven. Half past ten. Half past ten? Yeah. Oh, okay, half past ten. I just got it back in the yard, but this time I'm putting it there quite a good amount from the road. So, more than like they'll still uh, break in, but Messingham Zoo's been helping me tonight. <laughs> oh, God. <laughs> Hi. Well, don't think you can see much of us now because it's half past ten, quarter to eleven at night and we're finished. And we're going to get food. Okay, so a quick visit back the next day so Gemma could finish sealing the outside and the inside of the, uh, well, what was the window. And uh, that's it. We're just about done. Thanks for watching our video. If you did like it, please don't forget to click the like button and subscribe down below and click the little bell as well so you get notifications. Bye!